but we've all heard this of, okay, you've got a choice. There's a train speeding, it's got 100 people on it. And if you just, you know, do something, the train will, everyone will be saved, but this guy will die. So you've got 100 people on a speeding train. One man or woman, let's say one woman, if you kill her, everything will be okay and these people will live. What do you do? But nothing is ever that black and white. You know, and that's one of the reasons why I really don't like that thought experiment. Can everyone here still hear me okay? Okay. What about the other way around? What if you say 70 people in Aurora, Colorado are gonna be shot and 13 are gonna, be di are gonna die? But on that same night, one other woman just outside, and maybe in Wyoming, is gonna use a gun to protect herself. Are we sacrificing the many for the one? And that's what a lot of people take a look at. So a lot of people say, we're sacrificing the many for the one. And some people say, we're sacrificing the one for the many, to save the many. And again, it's not all black and white, but that's a kind of moral thing that we think about.